Hello everyone. Today I'm going to be showing you something I've been working on for quite a while now. And uh, I actually got the chassis complete. So here we go. Here's the Polymog 203A in its glory. Um, just finished the chassis. I'm still working on electronics as you can see they're setting up on top of my ARP Omni. Um, but the uh, chassis is almost 100% complete. Um, all the keys now work in a free manner. Good key bushings and uh, clean sliders. All the sliders move clean and free now. Um, polished the top, made it look real nice and neat. Um, really nice looking, looking synth now since I'm done with it. But um, as of right now, it still doesn't work. As I said, I'm still working on the electronics, getting all that done. But uh, if you remember on my last video, I had finished the reference oscillator, which is actually in an anti-static bag right now. Um, still got the fixed filters and resonant filter. And uh, I'm also, right now in the garage, is the voltage controlled filter for this thing. Um, it's still in the process of being restored. Um, but anyways, this is a quick look at it. Um, the complete chassis, pretty much. Um, just a few things are still missing I'm still waiting on uh, getting. One is the beat knob. I had to, as I said in my last video, I had to cut it off due to the screw uh, messing up that held this in place. Um, but anyways, I ended up having to just cut it off. But the pot's okay. I didn't cut the pot or nothing, so it's still good. And then also, one of the, uh, the uh, pre-var buttons is gone but I've got one of those coming as well. So it's going to be 100% after those two components. Um, but very nice keyboard. Um, it's going to be very nice when I'm done with it. Um, making progress for sure because this is a huge change from what it was when I first got it. So it's coming together very nicely. Um, but also for any of y'all that don't know the difference between a 280A and 203A, I know if you've heard me talk about the two a lot of my other videos. Well this is the 203A and basically what that is is this is the synthesizer model um, which means it has all the extra sliders over here. Now this is the 280A um, which as you can see they took away all the, um, the sliders that were over here on this side and it, but they added more presets. So if you look at this one and then look at this one there's only, only like uh, nine presets or really eight presets on this one and you got your VAR mode where you can actually combine sounds and then uh, tweak them but um, also you're very limited to what you can do on this one but still a good unit um, completely different filter design which makes this thing completely different than that but they're still very uh, similar in the architecture of the design but um Anyways, this is just a quick, uh, quick video to show the uh, the updates on the uh, Polymo 203A. Um, I also been working in the studio quite a bit. It's kind of messy right now, but um, added a three-tier keyboard stand, and uh, so getting things ready for the Poly to work. <laughs> so pretty exciting. But um, anyways, thanks for watching, and I'll have more updates soon. Take care.